Hey guys, Silence here. here. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Cafe Mix with me. And um, it was a great joy that Dragonite, Dragonite joined us yesterday. But now, <laughs> today, uh, there's a brand new edition of, well, the cafe card. You know, like for each event Pokemon that appears, there'll be a completion card that you can clear to gain all those wonderful rewards. At the same time, oh my goodness. Uh, there is actually... Let me see. Is the update here? Oh, it's not here. Okay, so apparently um, on my Nintendo Switch, the levels have been added. So 200 is no longer the largest amount of levels that is available in this game. It's currently 250. So I'm not too sure why the mobile version has not gotten the update yet maybe because i haven't updated the app i suppose all right so maybe let me just do a quick check and i'll get back to you guys in a while okay so after updating the app um the app is currently at version 1.3 sorry 1.3 0.00 .00. There's a lot of decimals in this version of the So anyways, um, as you can see here, now we have this It shows off, you know, the brand new Pokemon that we can have in our cafe And at the same time, two new menu items Yeah, and there we go It says here from 201 to 250 So I guess um, we are technically 100 levels away <laughs> Um, or rather 99 levels away from fully completing all the stages <laughs> Alright, and surprisingly enough I'm at third place I guess people aren't trying that hard Maybe, I don't know So let's do the usual stuff Oh, we can try to get Meowth to join us I don't know Yeah, let's just go with this don't want to waste the reset and end up with Pokemon that I've already befriended before. Alright, so we do need to clear a few stages um, with Dragonite later on. So let's just do this. There is one of these um, mission requirements that you need to activate Megaphone. So Starly is just the way to go right now. Oh no. Okay, so we just gotta keep the... <sighs> I don't know how about this. Um, we're just gonna do this. All right, break through as many of them as possible. All right, let's gather all the starly. All right, let's do this. Okay, we're gonna have to power up the skill a bit more. So let's just not touch them for the meantime. All right. What's up? Slurp puff going around. Make sure to destroy as many vegetables as possible. So yeah, before we could grab <laughs> the inner section, we could have touched a lot of more of the vegetable boxes. Okay, let's just get in there. All right, we're done. Got to recover the acorns that were used in yesterday's episode. A lot of acorns was wasted. Kind of. Alright, Munchlax, you're up. Ooh, this level. Why do we have to go through this trauma again? <laughs> okay, so let's try to do this. Stoutland. Stoutland seems like there's a lot more. Okay. Uh, let's destroy some of the caramels on this side. Squirtle. We are very close to gaining that icon skill, so there's really no need to guess. Waste all the Munchlexes. Oh no, that didn't go too well. 
Hmm. Okay, Stoplin. You, my boy. To help me out. Mm hmm. Let's see. Munchlex, maybe? Alright, there we go. Let's power this up. Alright, we've got all the vegetables that we need. Sadly to say, uh, we don't have enough for the chestnuts. Okay, we need this megaphone to be here. Yeah, we don't have enough for the chestnuts at all, so that's kind of a bummer. Hmm. So yeah, this stage really depends on luck. Uh, and you know, should I waste nine hundred acorns just for two stars or rather four stars across the board? Uh, no, I think not. <laughs> Let's quit this time round. Yes, we're gonna waste this stage away. Because it's just not um, advisable. Alright, Gino, let's go. Ooh, lots of chestnuts. Okay, so the cheese is in the way. So let's just clear the cheese and the honey in the top zone. Togepi, lots of Togepi. There we go. Spread it across the board. We could clear... Um, I don't know, maybe we should make use of this. Alright, since we have more excess now. Uh -huh. Alright, Togepi. We need you. Come on. Right, let's get Blossom going. That should clear all the honey. Now let's power this up and hopefully clear all the chestnuts. Well, we're short of one. Hey, there we go. <laughs> Comboing at the right moment. I guess that's probably the best outcome. Oh yeah, there's one other thing that they did mention in the update. Um, forgot to notify you guys. So here, um, where does it say? Special car. Oh, there it is. Max friendship has now gone to level 3. So level 2 is no longer the max. Um, so when max friendship level is raised, extra stars you previously earned will become available when you reach the max friendship level. So... Yeah, I think this helps um, lengthen the skill activation duration. You know, like if you can drag around the screen for a longer period of time. So yeah, Starly. Yeah, we need you because the mission card for Dragonite does require to ma activate megaphones. Uh oh. Oh, I do not like these kind of stages. Alright, let's get all the Starly so we can activate as many go let's clear as many things as possible okay charmander i suppose all right Kirilla. since there's a few of you fantastic Okay, let's get rid of the big ones. Alright, Sally, there we go. Alright, we've got all the whipped cream out. So we just got to destroy all of them. Alright, let's see. Um Charmander. Okay, we definitely have to retry again because um, 
the mission's clear is actually to use the um, the Starly skill itself. So that's a problem. Hmm. I remember struggling on this level quite a bit on my Nintendo Switch. So yeah, because it's just very troublesome to get that um, skill icon going. Maybe we should destroy some of the icons that are not Starly. Alright, then we can get Starly to join. And, you know, activate more skills. There we go. Destroying as many of the non starly icons as possible. There we go. Okay. We should do it. Fantastic. Alright, let's gather up all the starly as much as possible. Okay. This should do the trick. But you know, we are still short on some whipped creams. Uh oh. So that's a problem. <laughs> hmm. Won't be able to destroy them. Oh no. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so the trick for this level is technically to use as many starly gatherings as possible so we can get as many of the skill icons and of course we have to get as many of the whipped creams out as possible as well. Alright, let's gather them in the center, destroy all the non starly icons as much as possible. Go. All right. Can we gather all the? That wasn't such a good placement at all. Okay. There we go. We've got all the whipped creams out. So we do have a problem here. Maybe let's gather all the whipped cream into one location and get Starly going. Alright, that should do it technically. Just gotta be careful. Yeah! There we go. Took two tries. <laughs> But, you know, as long as we've got the strategy down, we should be good. Oh, Blossom's making his first visit. So cute. Hey, we've cleared missions, so let's claim the rewards. Alright, we just gotta clear seven more stages. We can have the second card appearing. Oh boy, this looks a bit complicated. So, pumpkins are an issue. We should clear um, the honeys at the side and leave the sugar cubes in the center because it's holding the pumpkins in place. So let's try to clear the honeys. Okay, and for this, maybe we can destroy Oh, we should have, we should have gotten rid of the honey that's blocking the way. Oh dang! Okay, let's do this. Okay, Evie, maybe we can push all the pumpkins together. Uh. 
many of them together as possible. Alright, so we are still okay. We've still got plenty of moves, technically. Okay, let's go for Eevee. We gotta clear as many of the things left rather than other than the pumpkins. I think we are pretty much good. All the pumpkins are done. It's just the score now. So let's gather as many icons as possible. Go. Hey! Didn't end up being too much of a hassle, which is fantastic. Blossom's first star! Oh, Pikachu's first visit. Lots of first visits this round. Always nice to have new faces joining us. Oh, Scotland. Let's go. Okay. Um let's see. We could go for those um, lanes that has the marshmallows littered up, especially the one on the far furthest right, because it has three marshmallows. Uh, let's get a more stop line. How about here? Oh, we were just clearing out the oil. Oh, okay. Togepi. Let's clear out the oil then. I guess technically we could use this here. Maybe we could. Oh, the acorn is out of the way. Oh, it has a megaphone skill as well. Oh, that's pretty neat. Okay, let's clear the oil. With this, we should be able to destroy this thing. more space for more icons. Okay. Hmm. Stop it. Alright, we can use this now. I'm gonna push. Oh we did we miss one? Yeah we missed one. Oh that's not good. Okay, so we could use this megaphone to clear this. And we could use this megaphone to clear this one. And just get a whole bunch of icons just for the score. Yeah, there we go. Could have ended a lot earlier, but it's okay. It just gave us more um, confidence in clearing the stage with you know, more moves to be used. Alright, Squirtle, you're up. Oh no. Okay, so the basket is all on this side though. Okay, um, let's use Munchlax first and destroy the sugar cubes. Alright, but I think we should. Um, technically avoid destroying the sugar cubes first because we need to get as many of the caramels as possible so that when they drop it's just basically tomatoes I hope you get the strategy okay much legs There we go. With this, I can power up the skill. Oh no, it should have moved in slightly more. I was so afraid to destroy the sugar cubes, but okay, that's fine. Um, Munch, let's, let's destroy the cubes now. Oh. Could have destroyed the cubes, but I got stuck. 
There we go. And with this, here comes... Alright, let's just get rid of all the icons as much as we can. Alright. Okay. There we go. Munch legs. Okay, Scoto. Let's rotate them around. Okay. I think we can still you know, make use of one more turn. Hey, there we go. Okay, so we are just gonna destroy every of the icons below that tomato so it can fall into the basket. Fantastic. Oh, it was sitting in the corner for quite a while. Oh, I was a bit worried. Alright, moving on. Minchino. We don't have Meowth yet though, so secondary Pokemon for the win. 55,000. Oh no. Okay, so there's something about this level that I have to warn you guys first. This is one of the hardest levels I ever cleared, mainly because the vegetable baskets and the piping bags, they are not in a fixed position. Every time you retry this level, the amounts change. Sometimes the level ends up with more piping bags than vegetables, and sometimes there are more vegetable crates than piping bags and the position that the outer piping bags and vegetable baskets are available for you to hit you know the most right lane um, set of items well they play a very crucial part on you clearing this level at all so let's try this we might end up redoing this level quite a bit Okay, there's more Lucario now, so let's go for this. Since we have lesser piping bags available, we definitely want to clear as many, or rather hit as many of the piping bags as possible. Okay, Nichino. Here we go. Um, Lucario? Awesome icons. There we go. And Gino again. You can tell that, you know, we are not gathering as much um, icons as we want, which is kind of a bad thing. So, yeah, you gotta really learn how to maneuver. There we go. Um, okay, we are almost done with the vegetables, so we just gotta clear all the whipped creams. Hmm. Okay, the small ones. Alright, and with this, we are done! Wow, I did it in one try! <laughs> so pretty lucky, so as long as you get the idea and if you had a technique to roll your icons on the screen like I did to, to gather them up the wall, you should be good. Alright, who's next? Wow, how far is second place? Oh, not that far, we are just three levels away. <laughs> okay, Starly. Oh no. Okay, there are acorns, not acorns, but kernels and marshmallows in the ice blocks. So we got to set them free, technically. So there we go. Got to spread around. Yeah, that's how you do it. Okay, um, got to set the ones in the bubbles free. 
Squirt though. Alright. Once you've set most of them free, um, technically just destroy as many of the marshmallows as possible. Alright. And if you can, bring all the corn down to the bottom level. Okay, let's see here. Okay, most of them are in the bottom level. I guess we can make use of this chance to destroy the corn. Oh, that didn't go well. Okay, Squirtle. We need them to destroy all the marshmallows. There we go. Once the marshmallows are done, technically, um, yeah, it's all the corn left. Oh, dang. How am I going to... Let's, let's see if I can push this down. No, it's too much of a risk. Oh, we just got enough for an icon? Lucky us! <laughs> okay. I thought I had to end up using up all my moves. So, that's pretty lucky of us. I wasn't even paying attention to the power gauge on the icon. So... Alright, let's keep going. Hmm. Dragon Knight, my boy. You are one big boy. It takes 18 stars to power up into level 2. Bulbasaur, let's go! So Bulbasaur is our X-Men because his skills destroy in the X-Manner. <laughs> okay. Um, just have to uncoat everything. So let's just gather and spread it out. Okay, Bulbasaur. go. Okay, can we destroy these guys? So, Bulbasaur also changes the icons to the most available. So let's get Mad Gather Minchino. Alright. Uncoat some of the corn. Okay, we can do this. Change the majority of the icons to the same thing that they were already were. Oh, that was just horrible luck. <laughs> okay, Meowth then. It would have been nice if there were more bubble saw, but I guess no, not every day is our lucky day. Chino. Alright, let's see. How many can we cover? Not a lot. Okay, not a lot of bubble sauce as well, but let's just gather as many as of them as we can. Oh, all the popcorns are together? That's fantastic, so let's just be careful and destroy all of them. Alright! Did way better than I expected. Moving along. Okay, Togepi. Togepi is a problem, means. Oh, it shows that this stage needs the combo. There it is, the 25 links twice. Holy crap. Okay, so um, we need more space for more icons to appear. So that's a problem. Let's get Squirtle first. Uh, let's destroy the bottom icons, I mean the sugar cubes. Gotta squeeze in there. Okay. We can get rid of chestnuts here. Okay, Charmander seems like there's a lot of them. I'm just gonna use them up for you know powering up the icons. 
level first. Okay, let's gather in as much as we can. Okay. Squirtle, there's a lot of Squirtle though. Maybe we should do this. Change the top row to all Squirtles. There we go, that's what we want. Alright, let's gather as many Squirtles as possible, covering as much of the sugar cubes. Yes! Okay, there's a lot of Charmander as well. So let's just clear as many chestnuts while changing them to Snubbles. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Three chestnuts left. Okay, we can use this to play the last chestnut. The well technically we are all good because this only needs one more destruction. Wow, fantastic. I mean I would have struggled on this level um, if I didn't know the strategy. I, I did struggle with this level on my Nintendo Switch. It took me almost I think one and a half days to figure it out. So <laughs> Yeah, because I was destroying the sugar kits from the top level and of course the icons would fall in from the sides but you know, it wasn't actually the most effective means of clearing the stage. So yeah, alright, opening up the gift because we are on the 10th level. Oh, we've got the card cleared. So from here on out, we definitely need to use Dragonite more. More acorns. Got to replenish those acorns. Complete orders while the friendship bonus is active. That one really depends on luck. And uh, sometimes, you know, the friendship bonus comes on those very difficult stages, so it really counts on luck as well. Completing orders with Dragonite, just three stages. I think that's pretty doable. Combining cafe skills, that one is very doable because it doesn't have to be Dragonite, so let's pay attention to that. So Slurpuff is needed. Let's see, what does Slurpuff do? Destroy icons from the birth. I don't know, let's try doing it with Dragonite first. After all, we need to clear that mission card. Although I might regret it later on. Oh no, it's this level. Okay, this level is very difficult. I struggled with this level for days. And yes, I had to use the 900 acorns to help me out as well. So let's do this. Um, you want to clear the honey first. The honey is the most annoying thing. Uh, and of course, the whipped cream. Let's see, we've got Michino, so let's go with Michino. Okay, we've got lots of charm in there. So technically, I understand why we needed Slurp Half now. Because it would be a lot easier to clear this level with a skill that destroys things upwards. So Let's see. Um, we're kind of running out of space. So let's use the Dragonite skill. Alright. And let's gather more icons here. There we go. So all the whipped cream are out. Um, the main reason why I didn't want to touch the caramels first is because the caramels can be pushed around. So technically that is a lot easier to clear. Okay, Charmander. Charmander has a lot of icons. Okay, Minchino. Alright, now all the honey is done. And we just have to clear the caramel and the whipped cream. So, 
Let's do this. Okay. Um, where is the third? Oh, okay. We can't use the skill because, well, oh, 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 oh my goodness! I was so afraid I was gonna fail because I wasn't touching the other two caramel. Oh my god, I can't believe I actually cleared this stage with just one try and with the Pokemon that is not recommended for the stage as well. Oh, and Dragonite's skill isn't exactly useful for this stage, so oh my goodness, that was just incredible. Alright guys, so one stage down for the card. Oh, I was so nervous. Oh, guess we're getting more stuff added. Hand blender? What are we gonna blend? Ooh, salads! My goodness, that actually looks so good. With this too, now we can make some mayo for salad. Huh. You know, in my days as a chef, we didn't have blenders to help make mayonnaise. We hand whisked everything. <laughs> and it was like... 10 liters worth of mayonnaise. You know how difficult it is to whisk 10 liters worth of mayonnaise? <laughs> ah, the old days. Oh, we are in second place. Very nice. Okay, oh wow. First place is only 8 stages away, or rather 8 stars away. Huh. Okay, so... Um, the levels... I think will be a lot easier from here on. Because I remember it was pretty much a breeze onwards after this level, so I'm going to continue on this episode because, um, yeah, we didn't do a long period or long duration video for a pretty long while. So let's do this. Since there are more levels being added to the game, we're going to have to try to do our best to, you know, push forward to get closer to the final stages of the game that is currently available. Oh, what is this now? Mayo obscures what's underneath. To reveal something covered in Mayo, make combos next to it. So, okay. Um, so it's mayonnaise first before the olive oil, or rather oil coating before the actual item. Okay. There's a lot of Pikachu. So let's go Pikas. Alright, let's get in there. Uh, so the main objective is to destroy marshmallows. So Charmander. Okay, stop them. There's a mayonnaise there as well. Make sure to destroy them while popping the bubbles. Charmander. Stop them. There's a lot of stop them. Alright. So let's see. Pikachu's. I mean, there's only three more. Oh. There's two left. Oh, there's one that is still in the bubble, though. So let's pop this on free. I'm gonna use this as an overkill. <laughs> we don't really need the score though. So let's just use the icons. We had to clear a mission that requires merging of the skills as well. So yeah, why not kill two birds with one stone? Alright, tutorial levels are always easy, which is fantastic. Anyone coming in with the friendship bonus yet? Apparently not. Okay, so this should be the last level we need to use Dragonite. Hopefully it's not such a stinger in terms of difficulty. 20,000 score and 8 tomatoes. Oh no, the tomatoes are inside the... Oh no. Okay, um... Let's try and 
slowly pop all of them. Okay, so where is the ones that are the tomatoes? I see a tomato already. Slurp off. Alright, let's let them slide in. Tomatoes, can you go into the basket? Thank you. Oh! I see most of the tomatoes are already inside this area. There we go. Okay, the, they are not the last three, but yeah, they are, well, two of them at least. Oh, wait, I see the third one. Uh oh, we are out of moves. That's not good. Come on, get in there. Ah, we ended up restart, re retrying this level. <laughs> oh no. Okay. It's not exactly a very difficult level, it's just. Okay, this level is pretty annoying. Um, so hopefully we can do this properly. Okay, we've got four tomatoes here. Let's just pop them. Alright, pushing all the tomatoes in first. Gathering as many icons as possible. Dragonite. Tomatoes in first. Priority goes to the tomatoes. Okay. Munch legs. Tomato go in, please. Okay. They won't go in because there were icons blocking. Where is the last tomato? Oh my goodness, is it this one? Oh yes it is! Okay, in you go please. In you go, there we go. Oh my goodness, we finally did it. That was so annoying. <laughs> okay, so it takes a few tries. Um, don't use uh, Acorn Refresher. This stage can be done, you know, just with normal play. Just keep trying. Right, we've got a mission cleared. So now we can start using all the regular recommended Pokemon. Snub. Hmm, 40,000 score, 3 pumpkins, and 20 popcorns. So, we're just going to power up the skill in the center lane. Um, maybe at the same time trying to pop the popcorns on this side. Okay, let's not use the skill yet. Because we just technically have to touch the popcorn for the third time. Alright, let's push this down. Go a whole bunch of them cleared at one go. Fantastic. Okay, we can still continue popping the popcorns because well, we need another of the icons to help totally destroy um, the pumpkins. Okay, so let's go for the pumpkins now. There we go. So the pumpkins are all set up. Now the problem is, well, the popcorns. Okay, we have enough megaphones to help us out. Okay, I'm gonna move this out. Destroy this one here, so we can make use of this. We'll destroy these two, and we're done! Pretty simple stage. Oh, 
the friendship bonus is here. Hopefully it's a level that we can clear easily. Sixty-four. Alright, Nichino, you are up for the job. Mm. Eighty thousand score. Nichino is the main icon. Oh no. Okay, so we got to start setting the baskets free. So just have to pinpoint where the baskets are. And you know, just just do your thing. So, the middle lane is the most important because there are three baskets that are available for me. Once again, this is one of those levels that really depends on um, RNG, where the icons are not always in the same position. So pay attention to that. Okay, so let's do this first. Once again, gotta learn how to. Um, swirl the icon so that they can get as much surface area covered as possible. Alright, so we're gonna use this to get the center lane cleared. We want to take advantage of those vegetable baskets. So yeah, okay. get as many of the icons as possible. There we go. Mm -hmm. and we can use this now on the bottom row. Alright, Togepi, there's a lot of Togepi. Uh, there's Charmander as well. Alright. Charmander. Be the man this time. Okay. Minchino. Let's just save the skill for now. Okay. Um, technically we are about done. Just gotta clear with the Minchino icons. Yeah, there we go. Gather all of them. They ask for two, we give them everything else. <laughs> Alright, so pretty easy stage if you get the uh, gist of it. With that, we've got our friendship bonus mission cleared. And I don't know if we have actually cleared the combination of the icons mission yet. Oh, we are still short of combining three icons together. Or the three sets of icons. Okay. Let's move on. Big boy is back for more. Forty thousand, four chestnuts. Oh no! Okay, so this stage is not too difficult. Just gotta dig in. Okay. All right. Uh. Yeah. Don't use the skills just yet because you have to see what you are destroying. Okay. So. Again, gotta unveil everything if possible. Okay, I think we are pretty good right now. Mm. Let's see, any more chestnuts? Mostly all caramel. So, we could combine these and go for the chestnuts. Oh, we missed on one. Yeah, that's okay. Okay, clearing the caramel first. Okay, so we just have to clear the caramels normally. Okay, getting the icon there. We can use this to clear the chestnut and use this skill to clear the two caramel. We could have ended this level a lot easier uh, earlier. So, um, 
yeah, just be cautious. Make sure you pop all the mayonnaise bubbles as quickly as you can. And if you can gather all the chestnuts to one corner and destroy them with the skill, uh, if the chestnuts on the upper level are within range of the diagonal, you know, skill of Kirillas, you're you're more than good. So a lot of variety on how you can handle this stage. So just be careful and you should be fine. Alright, so we did manage to combine the skills twice. So just one more time to clear that. Blossom is back for her second star. 40,000. Okay, so this one just play around with your swirling icons. <laughs> so this is where you learn how to, well, basically cover as much surface area as possible. Okay, that wasn't too good. There we go, that was much better. Much legs. Okay, Kayla. So maybe not do too much of a big movement. If they are in a good position, they are fine. Oh, I was trying to aim for three, but that's okay. Alright, so now we just have to get as much of the vegetables as possible. Okay, much legs, I suppose. Very nice. Okay, with this, we should be done. Because the megaphone is going to help us. Woo! Okay, that was pretty well done. Just pay attention to how much swirls you do. Maybe not be so aggressive at times if you have more icons um, of the same type near the baskets. So, yeah. Alright, clearing the mission. Let's unlock the next card. This is probably the best card clearing I've done on a video. <laughs> okay, complete orders with two or more moves remaining. Uh, that should be okay for certain stages. Clear Pokemon icons. 1005! Wow! I've got to use Dragonite's Cafe skill 10 times. Okay. I guess it's back to using Dragonite again. Alright, here we go. Uh oh. <laughs> this stage is more beneficial for Squirtle. Oh, this is not good. <laughs> not good at all. Alright, so let's try to do this. Lots of EV icons. Alright, let's get up all the Dragonite ones. Push them all out. Because Dragonite's uh, skill basically destroys to the right. So let's just make use of the space. Okay. Are we done popping most of them? Okay, most of them are uncoated right now, so that's pretty good. Very nice. Okay, let's get a Dragonite. Okay, Squirtle. There's a lot of Squirtle. Okay, Charmander. I think we're done. There we go. Oh, almost inch a bit too high. Fantastic. I lost count on how many skills I activated though. 
<laughs> Was it tree? Oh, we're in first place. Okay, we're done with the two or more moves remaining. Oh yeah, we activated twice. Okay. Let's see. How far do we need to go? I don't think we'll be staying in first place for too long though. Considering that I'm doing videos for this account. So. Oh, look at that. There's a lot of Dragonite icons that needs to be set free. Uh... Okay, I guess Squirtle is the way to go, but we've got to make sure to pop um, the whipped creams as well. So let's cover as much as we can. Alright, all the whipped creams are out, so we just got to play around. Get as much of the icons as possible. Okay, so if we could get all the whipped creams to drop down, we can blast it with Dragonite skill. So let's try and dig a path. There we go. And do your thing, big boy. Yay! All the whipped creams are gone. Now the only problem is uh, the remaining 44 Dragonite icons. So it's gonna take a while. Let's make sure to gather everyone. That is not Dragonite. Okay, Squirtle. Why are there so few Dragonite icons dropping though? Oh no, there's only five. Okay, we've got the five and we're done. <laughs> Not the best Pokemon to use for this level, but we managed to do it. So as long as you stick to the strategy, I think you should be fine. Alright, moving along. We're still sticking with Dragonite because we have to use his skill. Oh no. Okay, so... Huh. The best strategy for this, I don't know. Personally, I prefer to do it moving towards the left, so anti-clockwise, because we need space for the icons to drop. So let's do this this way. There we go. So we've got Minchino. Okay. Pikachu. Make sure you destroy all the honey that's formed. Because if not, you will have a problem later when you run out of space for icons to drop. Minchino. There we go. Let's get some Dragonite going. Okay, Pikachu. Alright, uh, Minchino. There we go. Okay, we can keep going because there's a popcorn here that needs to be destroyed. Okay, so we're gonna use Dragonite to push the icons down now. So let's do that. At the same time we could we could power up the skill to destroy as many as possible. Yeah, that's how you do it. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's gather more Dragonite first. And push everything down. 
Okay, let's combine this. So Dragon X skill cast twice, so that's going to help us out greatly. Okay, we've only got the two honey left, so let's... Oh, we should have used the skill though. That's okay. There we go, used up all the moves. But that could have been a very difficult level. I struggled on the level a lot as well. So if you guys hit my strategy, you should be fine. So slow anti-clockwise. Oh wow, we've reached another 10th level. Alright, here we go. Hopefully we don't struggle too badly on this level with Dragonite. <laughs> Oh no. So yeah, this is one hard level. Um, technically, the strategy is to destroy the sugar cubes on either side and to set your icons free. So let's do this. Make sure you cover as many as possible. Okay. There you go. Get there together as much as possible. Okay, you might want to be careful on getting the whipped creams activated because they do take up your Pokemon icons. So, yeah. Alright, let's do it this way now. Okay, with more with more of the caramels being destroyed, that gives you more chance of uh, icons appearing as well. So pay attention to that. All right, fantastic. Okay, so with this, we can start going for the whipped creams. Okay, Michino. With this, we should be able to clear a lot of the whipped creams. Technically. Pikachu. Cover the whipped creams. At the same time, the sugar cubes. Okay. This looks bad. Oh, can we clear both? Yes, we got lucky. I was hoping that the gap wasn't too wide. <laughs> Thought we'll be ending up destroying one only so whew, thank goodness all right with that we've reached 20 stages okay i guess with this pace we're doing um we're doing quite okay oh dragonite says hello to his own self <laughs> okay so as always guys i'm gonna leave the episode here hopefully you guys are enjoying yourself playing this game and as usual let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of the new addition to the stages the new expansion of um, two more food items on the menu and you know the pokemons that are available now for adding to your cafe and of course let me know how you guys are doing and if my tips and tricks are helping you guys out if they are Make sure you leave a like on this video if you're brand new to the channel. Subscribe for more help and tricks for Pokemon Cafe Mix coming your way soon. Until then guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!